Yo, what's up? Today I'm going to teach you how to kickflip. Kickflip is pretty hard, so uh, I would recommend learning ollie first or some other easier tricks like 180 or pop shove. Uh, you don't have to learn those tricks first, but uh, it's just easier and a lot of people who skateboard like quit because they get frustrated, so it's good to have like easy stuff down first so you you know, less frustrated and can actually do tricks for the park. For foot placement, you want to put one foot on the tail, obviously. Um, I like putting it more forward um, because then having my front foot here um, makes it so the board's like more balanced, but you can just put it like directly on the tail. So your front foot, you want it diagonal like that right below the second screw, so like right there. You don't want to put your foot like this because you might miss the board when you're flicking it and the board won't flip it at all. And also if you have your foot here, you have more control on where to go. Whereas if you're here, the board will like turn, you'll start like turning sideways. When I first started kickflips, um, I really struggled and I had my foot not diagonal like this and it made it really hard and it also made the board like turn like a shove but I did land it I mean technically you can do a kickflip with your foot anywhere but if you have it right there make sure it's diagonal and then just flip so what you want to do you want to stand out of the tail like this and you want to put your foot right there and you want to practice flicking right there. Just flick that exact point. And I was learning these. I didn't pay attention to where I was flicking. I was just flicking randomly. And so the board wouldn't always flip the right way that I wanted it to. But if you flick that spot right there, it should always flick under your feet and land every time. The problem I had was... I was kicking my foot out, but all you have to do is take your foot and go like that. So you literally don't move your leg at all. Your leg stays in the same spot and you just flick like that. Also, your foot, you just pop it like an ollie, jump up, and you should catch it with your back foot. What I found is it's a lot easier to commit to the trick if I do it into grass and I found I could land it a lot more easily because there's no like fear of an injury and you can just do whatever. Make sure your balance is even. So if you lean back more, the board's going to fly forward. If you lean forward, the board's going to fly that way. So just keep your shoulders with the same length as your feet. A lot of people who are beginners are going to start off doing it stationary but once you get comfortable riding around and comfortable with your board and ollies uh, it's actually easier to do it rolling but you also might find it easier to do it fakie too 